Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today is the day. As you can see in front of you, my packages have arrived, and we're going to do some unboxing. With that said, let me grab my knife, and let's pop open these boxes so you all can see what I ordered. All right, let me get rid of these as much as I can. Um, as you can see, the first box is an Allen and Ginter hobby. We'll go... This looks like the Panini Prism. And it is, with a Cooney on the front. This one is empty, so in lieu of having packing peanuts all over the place, I'm just going to relocate them to this box. Here's my box of Gypsy Queen. Gold label. Oh, just realized I had the Aria get out. I had the camera on the wrong box. It's still there. And stadium club. Say hi to Aria. Alright. I believe that's everything in here. So in total. Um, five boxes and the card sleeves. card sleeves. And this is a Panini Prism Hobby box. Hopefully the lighting is okay. It's a little dark in here, um, but it's also a lot quieter. I'm in my office instead of my kitchen. So, 12 packs per box. Or I'm sorry, yeah, 12 cards per pack and 12 packs per box. So this one is 12 and 12. Excited to open those. I thought they were really, really nice looking cards. Allen and Ginter. I'm not super stoked about these. I bought them just because I've never opened them before. Um, but in the meantime, I've been looking at you know a handful of YouTube videos, and I'm not nuts about you know the kind of gimmicky cards in here. But I do like the art style. Um, so this is a Alex and Ginter hobby box. And I'm not sure how many packs are in here. I think it's 24. Yeah, so it's got it right there. Um, 24 packs, 8 cards per pack. My Gypsy Queen box. Um, I think this one is also 24. Let me see if it... Yes. 24 packs per box. Um, eight cards per pack. And then good old Bryce Harper on the front. Love to see that. <laughs> um, the next box is the Topps Gold Label with Luis on the front. And this one is extremely small, but 33 cards per box. Um, I'm not sure... How many packs are in here? If I had to guess, you know, maybe 10, three cards per pack, although that's not super efficient. And then last is the Top Stadium Club. This one, I believe, is 16. Yes. So 16 packs per box, eight cards per pack. So in total, I've got five. Um, my plan for opening these is doing a box a day or a box per video. Um, some are obviously going to be longer than others, so I might combine the Topps Gold label with, you know, one of the bigger sets. But, um, I'm really looking forward to getting back in the hobby. And I'm excited to see what we get. So, I am going to start opening now. I haven't decided which one I want to do first. What I think... Now that I'm thinking about it, it's getting a little late for me, so I don't want to be here a while. Um, I think I'm going to open 12 of the Paninis and maybe the Topps Gold Label. Um, and then the rest for, you know, another video. So I'm going to set these aside and get my camera set up. <clears throat> so let's cut up, let's cut into these and see what we get. In 
terms of what's in these, I'm opening them more just because I want to get back into the hobby and less chasing specific cards. So, you know, obviously I'm looking for any, anything valuable, you know, to potentially get my investment money back. That's anybody's goal. You know, whether that happens or not, we'll see. Um, but I'm not looking for a specific rookie card. I'm not looking for specific autos. Um, you know, forgive me if I'm not super familiar with some of the players. I obviously know the stars. I've been following baseball more or less my whole life. Um, but it's possible that the rookies I just don't recognize. Let's see. Pack number one on the channel of the Panini Prisms. Pull my camera just like that. You should be able to see all the cards. Um, in the future, I think I'm going to get a little more light here just because the shadows might make it difficult to see. And my lighting right on top is not in a great place. So the first card is Juan Soto. We've got Willie Adams. <laughs> Speaking of Bryce Harper, there he is. Kirby Yates. I believe that's Cole Hamels behind it in red. Um, but Rue. Cole Hamels, you know, the Atlanta legend. He pitched maybe a game this whole season. It's Krilloff. Fernando Tatis Jr. Illumination. Um, I'm not super familiar with inserts. When I last selected cards, it was in the 90s. And I loved inserts. I love the specialty cards. I love number cards. I love inserts like this. I don't believe this card is numbered. It is not. Um, I also don't know enough about them to know how special this is. There is a little bit of gold here. I think that's just because he's a Padre. Um, but that's that's a sweet card. JT Real Muto, Clevenger, Paul Goldschmidt, and Starlin Castro. Um, I also don't know if Panini Prism has any rookie cards. We didn't hit any there. Actually, we did. Tatis is a rookie. Um, you know, this wasn't a specific rookie card. It was an illumination, but regardless, there are rookies in here. Just answered my own question. So we're going to sleeve him up and see if there's anything else I missed. Obviously, we got a lot of good players in this pack here. Um, this was also an ins I, I call it inserts. I don't know if they're actually inserts anymore, but anyway. But now on deck with Krilloff. I'm not familiar with who he is. The red Cole Hamels probably has next to no value. The Ryu, Bruce Hooper. <laughs> uh, I spend too much time on the Atlanta subreddit. But any anyway, Braves and Juan Soto. Again, not a bad pack. I believe there are three autos in here on average. Um, you know, obviously, it would be great to get all three. But I'd be happy with at least two. Dallas Keuchel, Jacob deGrom, Ken Giles. I also really, really like these cards. Um, my, my overhead lighting shines exactly on this corner, which makes it a little difficult. Um, but I try to get lighting so I can see the cards best. That doesn't mean it, it gets picked up on camera. These cards are really, really nice. And we've got what looks to be a blue refractor. I'm not sure if that's what these are called with Prism, but anyway, it's Ronald Bolanos. He is a rookie. Um, definitely going to sleeve that up. I have no idea if that yields any value whatsoever, but um, Dakota Hudson in red is behind him. We have a DJ LeMahieu Machines. We've got Brian Anderson. He's looking really good in Miami. Uh, Dakota Hudson again. Jimenez, Ronald Acuna Jr., and Danny Mendick, who is also a rookie. Um, so any of the rookies I pull, I'm going to sleeve just for to preserve value. Again, you know, they might be nobodies right now. You never know. Let's flip this upside down. Oh, anyway. Pack is 
a little stubborn. Still searching that number one auto, or my first auto. No luck so far. Um, Brad Keller, Giolito, Castillo, Noose, rookie card, Cody Bellinger, fireworks. Um, it's not a different color, and the whole thing is not shimmering, so I don't believe this is a refractor. Yamamoto. Bobby Witts Jr., top of the class. Not familiar with who he is. Stargazing Aaron Judge. The back of the card. SG9 is the number. This is not a numbered card. Gavin Lux rookie card. Rio Garcia, Travis Demerit, and Yu Chang. Lots of rookies in this one. Um, definitely going to sleeve up the Gavin Lux. The others I'm going to set aside. Um, definitely going to sleeve up the Aaron Judge Stargazing. Very cool card after he hits one of his bajillion home runs. Bobby Wood Jr., I'm not sure with who he is. Set those aside for now. Blue rookie card, Cody Bellinger, gonna sleeve that up for sure. There you go. Hey, hey, buddy. Say hi. Come up for a visit. Mm -hmm. What's up? Say hi. Say hi to everybody. Hey, YouTube. slow. I'm just enjoying the moment. This is the first pack of cards I have opened up in a long, long time. And I believe the autos in this, I don't know if there are relics in this set. I don't believe there are. Um, the autos are just, you know, on base cards if I remember correctly. Munoz, Austin Meadows, Josh Bell. This is a base refractor of Noose. So I just spoiled it. I know this card's upside down. This is the first auto. It is Donnie Walton. And it is a base rookie card. Very, very cool. up so y'all can see Donnie Walton so the autos in these are stickers um, which I'm perfectly okay with you know I I do think it looks a little better if it's signed directly on the card but this is still really really cool that is my first ever autographed baseball card I have lots of memorabilia um, but never an autograph card I have relics but no autos that's my first one. Merrill Kelly, Dylan Cease rookie card, Xander Bogarts, and Azale. As a whole, I don't think this pack was a hit, but I did get the auto, so it's hard to be upset with that. So that's one. Um, you know, hopefully we get three. I I don't based on average. I don't. Based on averages, I suppose it's possible to get more than three in a box, um, which would be amazing. Look, we're obviously looking for three, and we're almost 50% of the way through. Now that I know that the upside downs are cards, or the backwards cards are autos, I'm going to try to build a little bit more suspense and hide it. Um, anyway, Jack Flaherty, John Means with Baltimore. Dustin May rookie card. He didn't pitch great against Atlanta, um, but still, he uh, he's definitely a promising prospect. Josh Rojas in red. Who else? I don't believe we've hit a numbered card yet. Um, the auto was not numbered. I'm 
trying to get the lighting right so you can see this one. It's a little difficult. Anyway, that's Schwarber with the uh, Cubs. Charlie Brackman. Brackman. <laughs> Charlie Blackman. Um, Brilliance. It looks like it's got a little bit of green. I don't think that matters in this particular card. That is also not numbered. It's just an insert. Alberto. Logan Webb. Another Dustin May rookie card in the same pack. Look at that. And Chris Paddock. I'm going to hold off and sleeve, I'll sleeve those at the end. Um, I want to get through a few more here as time is ticking away. It's very late at night here in Georgia. Nico Horner, James Paxton, Marco Gonzalez, Zooch. Had one stuck here. This is a red refractor, German Marquez. It's probably Germain, not German. <laughs> DJ Lemayhu, blue card. Now on deck, Taylor Trammell. Again, this being my first video in my office. Um, I know unless I have natural lighting, it's going to be a little bit difficult to see the cards, specifically these. Garrett Cole. Marco Dubon. It's, it's, dark on he it's dark in here on top of the lighting in this room not being the best. So I do have lamps. I might have to get an overhead light to help if I'm going to continue using this room. Again, I've got my desktop mic in here, which I believe is going to yield much better audio. So I'd rather film in here instead of my dining room kitchen area. All right. Got the Tampa Bay rookie. Howie Kendrick. Buster Posey. Michael Chavis. Valued Collector. All right. So, I'm going to read this. Um, this says, Valued Collector, a redemption for this card can be secured in your name when you submit the request to Panini America. This redemption card must be redeemed by the expiration date listed on the back. So I got a redemption, which is awesome. I don't know who it is. Oh my God, it's Alvarez. So I got a redemption. As soon as this comes into focus, I hope it does. I don't know how to manually focus with a GoPro if you even can, um, but anyway. Rookie Autographs, card number 49, Jordan Alvarez. That is amazing. <laughs> that is so cool. Eugenio Suarez, Jacob deGrom Brilliance, Miggy, Mookie, Trevor Bauer, and Yelich. This was an amazing pack, even from a base card standpoint. Lots of, you know, superstars. Um, this Alvarez Redemption is amazing. I am so excited. <laughs> it looks to be about 25 bucks. That's what at least one is sold for. You know, I. it's still really, really exciting. It's awesome. Hold on to that one for a long time. All right, so we got two autos. Hopefully we get our third. Rosario Hendricks, and I apologize if my thumb's in the way. Bustakas, Grisham, Nolan Arenado Refractor. All right, base card, but you know, still a refractor nonetheless. 
Got a red rookie from Tampa Bay. Scooball from Detroit. Alex Brigman. Luzardo rookie card. And Otani, who unfortunately is not having a great year. He's not really living up to expectations, in my opinion. Good news, if the Angels wanted to get rid of him, um, you know, he would fit in with National League should the DH be continued overpass this year. Brandon Lowe. I believe he pronounces it Lau, actually. Brandon Lau. Kyle Lewis, rookie card. Luke Weaver. Manny Machado. It's Chris Paddock. Devers. These feel really good. That's a weird thing to say about a baseball card, but it feels really good. Nelson Cruz. And this should have a stat on the back based on that 311 average, I believe. Vigio. Suarez and Walker Bueller. Jack McNeil. Not a bad pack. Still looking for that auto. Got my cat's litter box in the bathroom right next to my office. And of course he's in there right when I'm trying to film. <laughs> Joey Votto. Baez. Jonathan Gray. Chu. We've got a gold... I just revealed a card there, but anyway, we've got a gold Anthony Rizzo stargazing. I find it hard to believe that this it is numbered. It's four out of a hundred. It's Anthony Rizzo. It's gold. I have no idea what the value is on this card, but I'm pretty excited about it. And I'm fairly certain this is an auto of Patrick Sandoval. And it is. It is a red refractor auto Patrick Sandoval rookie card. He is with the Los Angeles Angels. I have no idea if he's any good. I've never heard of this guy. That's a pretty sick card. Altuve Fireworks. Thorpe. Some of these you can see me through the reflection. <laughs> Devers, Tanaka, and Corbin. Go ahead and get this guy sleeved up. Sleeve up Rizzo as well. That is not a refractor, but it's a gold prism. I believe this was numbered. Yes, this was numbered as well, actually. Patrick Sandoval was 64 out of 75. Anthony Rizzo was 4 out of 100. Alright, so we've gotten our 3 autos. There's a chance we could get a 4 um, based on the law of averages. Let's see Max Freed. He had a hell of a year for Atlanta. Um, first, Aaron Judge. Goodrum. Evan Longoria. Shane Bieber, good, good card to have. Steven Strasburg. We've got a red Albert Pujols. We've got Anthony Rendon scorching, which is not numbered. We got a Bryce Harper instant impact, which is not numbered. Um, Max Kepler, Nelson Cruz. Tim Anderson, and as we knew, Max Freed. Not a bad pack. Last out of our Panini Prisms. Rodriguez, Turnbull, Lorenzo Kane. Bray with Houston. We've got a green Garrett Cole. 
which is numbered. This is 110 out of 125 in the top left corner there. Blue Zach Gallen rookie card. Brett Beatty. Joey Gallo. Marte. Boyd. Carpenter. And Garver. This took a little longer than expected. Um, I went fairly slow, just enjoying the moment. This was an absolute blast. These were the first packs of cards I had opened in probably about 20 years. And uh, I'm really, really, really excited to get back into this and to crack more cards. So with that said, I'm going to end it here and not open up the gold label. And I will see you all next time.